Hi, I'm Caroline Dunn. I'm here at Piedmont Park with world-ranked, all-American track and field athlete and lifetime run coach, Tina Klein. On Thursday, November 3rd, hundreds of women will come right here to Piedmont Park for Gildan Esprit de Chie 5K and 10K. Tina, tell me about Gildan Esprit 5K and 10K. Well, first of all, this race would not be possible without the title sponsor, Gildan Esprit de Chie. Gildan Esprit de Chie is the ultimate girls night out where it's, we offer a timed event. There are two events, a 5K and a 10K, and it's all about celebrating our potential as women and fitness as well as life. It's a wonderful event with a supportive and fun atmosphere. There are hundreds of women that come together and they're celebrating their accomplishments. And it's a healthy and fun way to celebrate each other and celebrate life. The theme this year is be your potential. You'll actually get one of these goodie bags as well, but it's really fun because it reminds you of reaching your potential. So Tina, is this race for runners or walkers? Actually, the race is for both. We, we have runners, we have walkers. If you're running and walking combination, we welcome that as well. It's for all levels, all abilities, and it's about reaching your potential. This year, we have a very special medal. It's all about celebrating your women, the, the women's accomplishments, and the cool thing, it even comes with a removable pendant. Oh, hey, this pendant is cool. It says potential on it, so you can wear it um, to work or to school later on. It's great that this race promotes women and fitness, but is there a local charity component? Actually, there is. Gildan Esprit de She is a proud charity partner of Girls on the Run Atlanta. And it's a terrific organization that uses running to help young women honor their voices, their accomplishments, their gifts, and celebrate their bodies. So Tina, what does the race shirt look like? I'm glad you asked. They're really, really cool. Most races hand out regular shirts, regular t-shirts, but Gildan Esprit de She hands out great running tanks. It's a $40 market retail value, but as you can see, it has be your potential. And in the back, it's really cool. It's a tank that says finisher. Lightweight, awesome quality, awesome fabric. This race is great. The bling, the shirt, but I heard there's more. Oh, there's a lot more. We are gonna have a bubbly bar, we're gonna have great food, great music, and a Panasonic beauty bar that's going to treat all our participants with massages, manicures, get your hair braided. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Again, it, it's, all about, it's all about the life and health and fitness of women. Tina, does this race include photographs? Absolutely, and I'm glad you asked. We are having free race day photos. It's a free digital download of your photos. It all sounds good. Is it too late for me to register? Absolutely not. Registration will be open on November 3rd from 4 to 6 p.m. So Tina, let's get down to business here. What are your inside tips for getting the most out of Gildan Esprit de Chie? Well, first of all, you want to get here early to take part in the lifestyle market, which opens up at 4. And packet pickup is from 4 to 6 p.m. And if you haven't registered, that is the time that you want to register. But I do want to point out quickly regarding transportation. How do I get here? And of course, I drive. I drive everywhere. But maybe this is something that you can... Uh, I know that you love public transportation. Do you have any tips for me or for runners that don't take don't uh, usually take MARTA. Well, I just wanted to point out that MARTA is only a few blocks away, Midtown MARTA Station, or there are plenty of rideshare services here in Midtown Atlanta that you can take advantage of. Getting back to your question about, you know, some inside tips, one of the things you want to do, again, getting here four to six, because you get to get your packet. If you haven't registered, you can register. You can have gear check. We're going to have people here so you can check in your gears. So you don't have to worry about keeping it safeguarded or having someone watch it or running with it. You also want to take part in the, the, the whole lifestyle market that's opening up. Visit the vendors and our sponsors. At 6.05, we're going to offer Zumba, so nice little warm-up, getting ready. At 6.30 is when the 5K race starts. So you want to make sure that you're here by definitely by 6 so you can get warmed up. But 6.30, 5K starts. At 7 p.m. is when the 10K starts. And the 10K, just FYI, it's a two-loop 5K course loop. What time does it close? Well, I'm glad you asked about that too because we are going to have food and a bubbly bar and whatnot, but the course does close and the lifestyle market will close at 9.30. So you want to make sure that you enjoy the festivities, enjoy all the sponsors that are going to be out here, but by 9.30 we'll be wrapping it up because it is a Thursday night and we have to get back to work on Friday. Tina, what if I have a friend who's injured and can't actually walk 3.1 miles and what do we do with the men? Yeah, what do we do with those men? Um, <laughs> great question. 
first of all, I know there's some people that may have gotten injured or, or was had set back from their training. So if you're, if you're not able to participate, still come out, get your packet, enjoy the festivities and also volunteer. If you want to volunteer, come out and help and be part of the sport. Just because you can't run doesn't mean you can't be out here and cheering and volunteering. And also for men, we do have men, a few good men that are going to be running the course. However, if men want to come out here, maybe meet someone, who knows, but if they want to come out here and volunteer, we'd love to have them as well as volunteers. You know, we, we love our volunteers. And if they want to come out here, hand out goodies, hand out little glow-in-the-dark bracelets, we'd love to have you. So. Don't feel that just because you can't run or you're injured or you're male that you can't be part of it. We want everyone to be part of this. Again, it's it's about reaching our potential. So we welcome everyone. If you can't run, come volunteer, and we look forward to seeing you guys. Thank you, Tina. I know all about the Gildan Esprit de She race. I'm really looking forward to it. Thanks for all the inside tips. Be your potential! potential.